In an issue of the South Place Monthly Record Journal from 1928, there's an announcement of the construction of Conway Hall in London, which is to be the new home of the oldest surviving free thought organisation in the world. It reads, The principal entrance will be in Red Lion Square and, in a niche opposite the door, will be a bust of Dr Moncure Conway. So why then is that niche downstairs so deliberately built to house the bust of the man for whom the building was named, empty in 2016? Or rather, why has Conway's bus never sat there at all? Not for one single moment.